Rivers, open. Jackson drops it, and Poamalu almost makes the interception. In fact, they play on the field as if he did. I thought it hit the ground. Poamalu is still on his feet. He's able to shake free from three hits and still going. Now he falls on his own. Let's see if it's a pick. Unbelievable. What a catch. Wow. I don't know. Still not sure. He got his hand underneath there. Take another look. And they run it. Barber better be careful. They've got him in the end zone. Asani Samuel has a shot. Now Green, how does he escape? Unbelievable run by Marion Barber to save two points. Puts it up deep, and oh, look where by Brandon Lloyd! An incredible catch! A one-handed leaping catch by Brandon Lloyd! This is one of the best catches you'll ever see, ever. Here's the running back. Play action. And Manning's going to heave one. There's, oh, there's a flag. Back on that one-handed catch. How in the oh, world? Oh, my goodness. And Brandon Carr was back there. I mean, he is insane. How do you make that catch? Oh, my goodness. This is sick. Put this to music. I don't think he stepped out either. That may be the greatest catch I've ever seen. Defense number 39. Penalty's decline. Result of the play. Touchdown. You have to be kidding me. That is impossible. Under pressure. Oh. And it's caught by Barber. Barber at the 40, the 35, and out of bounds at the 28 yard line. Oh, that was a pinball machine at work. That ball was in and out of four different hands. It's who is going to come up with it at the end is the important thing. Pastorini is under a lot of pressure. They had a four man rush this time, and he just does get it away as he gets hit. The ball is thrown high. There's one hand on it. That was Wilson. Gordon. Gordon. Still keeping it alive. It's like volleyball. Wilson again. Wilson again. He had two shots at it. Still didn't come up with it. Barber finally coming up with it and makes a good move, not only to gain yards, but get out of bounds. One of the new NFL rules in effect here in the playoffs. One teammate to another. A legal catch. And Houston is. Pop still has it. Throws in the end zone. It's intercepted by Ed Reed. He gets away from Cobb and he is still going down the sideline. Brent Selleck trying to cut him off. Reed needs one more block. He goes all the way. Touchdown. I think the fact that they're only down by 10 still gives them a little hope. They haven't been able to do anything and they're only down by 10 points. McDab throws. And the pass is almost picked up. It is picked up. Seahorn came up with it. Jason Seahorn is going to take it in. Drop straight back. Giants on a blitz. McNabb hit as he throws. Swings it right. And the pass nearly it is intercepted by Seahorn. He's got it on the run. Down the left sideline. Cuts it at the 10. Five. Touchdown. What a play by Seahorn. Unbelievable athleticism. Here's Edelman broken up. And the pass is no sign yet. Edelman comes down with a football, and they're saying it's a catch. And we'll get another look at this. Alford knocked it up into the air, and let's see who comes down with it. Oh, that's a catch. Oh, my God. That's incredible. That's amazing concentration by Julian Edelman. To get in the contest. Finally got him. The Vikings don't have a receiver covered out there. But now yeah. they do. They got a linebacker on it. Young comes out of there. 
Still on his feet is Steve Young. And still. And Steve Young still going. Young cuts back. Young cuts down. Touchdown. Big opening for Tony Dorsett. Look out, he's oh, got great no. speed. 99 yards and a half. Dorsett down the sideline. Stays in bounds. Can you believe that? And short. Short because they're 99 yards. Short yardage defense all bunched up. And that's that's the 99 and a half yard run, I think, is the longest run in the history of the league. It is. And the sack in the end zone is not outside the realm of foot. Here comes Smith. There's Cunningham. Dodges left and puts it way downfield for Fred Barnett, who has the catch. And the race is on. There are no flags. A 95-yard touchdown. Third and ten. Four-man rush. And then coming through at the last moment, but escaping, McMahon rolling to the outside, coming back this way, has a lot of room, is going to launch one. He was behind the line of scrimmage, and that is Freddie Mitchell making the catch. That is amazing. Read into the ball, and he lines it down the field. It bounces, and Cripps had it bounce off him. That's a live ball. Back by the goal line. He's got to come out with it. He's to the 5. He angles. He's up the sideline. He's still running. He's to the 20, 25, 30. He's to the 40. He's down the sideline and angles left. He's to the 35, 30, 25, 20. He's got blockers in front. 5. Touchdown! Joshua Cribs turns disaster into a score. Unbelievable run. 100 yards for Cribs. He went to pick up the bouncing kickoff and the big question is does he step out of bounds no 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 what a, what a high wire act you said it right incredible and this time 100 yards that's as close as he came look at the green outside the foot very clear and what a balancing act the divot mark even proves at the touchdown but on the ensuing kickoff Hold me closer, tiny Danzler. Hey, the headlight on the highway. Woodrow, tiny Danzler, the former college QB and future tightrope walker in the circus. Could go all the way. They took another look. We want to take another look. It was 84 yards of brilliant. Yeah, you walk, watch along the sideline. It's like the triple jump in the Olympics. Huh. He stays on his right foot. Obviously stayed in bounds. Great call and maybe the play of the year. And here's the guy that does. Rams penalized five of the fourth and 12 and are 18. Deion Sanders brought his arms up again just for a moment and Hatcher kicks it a mile. I mean a mile. Deion drifts to the left, takes it on the 32, dropped it. Picked it up. One man missed him. Another man missed him. Now he's going wide off to the right. Deion to the 25, to the 30, to the 35, the 40, the 45, the 50, the 45, the 40. My God, Deion Sanders is going to score. My God because he has to be his go-to guy tonight. Third down and three. Manning goes down as he gets it away, and that is a phenomenal one-handed interception by Cromarty. You're always hearing about a guy who's a great athlete. Well, I tell you what, when you watch that run back last week, when you watch what he does tonight, when you watch that pick, that is a great athlete. I remember, I've seen a lot more than that. No, I've never seen it where it goes all the way down. The size that's fake is a good one. This pass is not. It's picked off by Eric Allen. Allen still spinning, still finding room, and Allen comes out of the back. Eric Allen still on his feet. Eric Allen at the 40. Allen is going to go all the way. Eric Allen steps into the end zone, and the Eagles are ahead from 94 yards away. Kenneth Davis. He's going to go the distance. Touchdown, Bills. It's 
still see Dick Vermeil's face around the highways of Philadelphia. What a catch! What a pick! Unbelievable! Mike Mamola! Mamola into the end zone! Now lead 24-17. That was just incredible. That was great. That's going to make a highlight reel. Mamula reaches up to bat the pass, hooks it with his left hand, and pulls it in. Has a fractured finger and a bruised knee. Fourth down, Craig follows it. That ball's free. Craig gets it back, looks in the end zone, wide open. Oh, unbelievable! Oh. Wow, Danny Green. Larger lost it. A Ram had it. A Ram could have fallen on it. <laughs> It bounced into the hands of Craig. And what a cool cucumber Dave Craig is. Take a look at it again. A Ram had an opportunity. Number 22. Vince Newsom could have picked it up. He bounced into Craig's arm and can't say enough for him keeping his cool. You know, you get some sinkers in there and you and they give those guys a little extra weight. Roger Craig still on his feet, still running. What a run by Roger Craig. You'll never see a better one than that. From 46 yards. Play clock at five. Pass is intercepted at the goal line by Malcolm Butler. Unreal. They try to pick play, Al. They tried to go here, but he beats him to the punch. And I'm sorry. But I can't believe the call. Me neither. I cannot believe the call. You've got Marshawn Lynch in the backfield. You've got a guy. Fire when the strong hits you. That's it, friend.